Hello, this is uh, Women Zoom, and uh, I am Arthur Nora. It is a special case now. I have invited two ladies, two Russian ladies with a good career being part of this program. Sure, speaking about what they do and why they are so special to me. And uh, I have the, the pleasure to introduce to you Elena Mizernaya, which, who is a very impeccable person, actress, model, human rights activist. And Bella Levy, who is the founder of Bella Levy Foundation, ambassador of hope, and Miss Howard County 2021. Thank you, ladies, coming to this program. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's been an honor to have you. And thank you so much to Elena. Honor thank you. to me Thanks. having you here. So, Bella Levy Foundation is helping those who are under contact rape, educate to prevent any kind of abuse and children and adults. May you please uh, translate this to the other viewers. What do you do? Of course, thank you so much for asking me that question. The Bella Levy Foundation was established as a result of a need, a need for a desperate humanitarian effort, a need to stop every woman's heart, every mother's heart from breaking, a need to bring the world together. Basically, the Bella Levy Foundation was created after my name, and it's called the Blue Ribbon Project. And the Blue Ribbon stands for awareness. And I want to bring about awareness, education, and prevention against anti-human trafficking. As we all know that we all come from different parts of the world, but this one thing, this plague, this, this infestation in our world, this, this horrible thing exists, not only at the tip of your nose, not only in your neighborhood, but in the entire globe. Yeah, for sure. To our region also is the same problem with this, uh, let's say, very terrific uh, happening. Yes. Um, so that's good. You work to such, uh, let's say, very important project, but it is not a simple thing. May you tell yeah. about the difficulties? May you tell about the hard work you have to do? Thank you so much. First of all, I have to give credit where credit is due. None of this is possible without my amazing support system. So Yelena, I would like to take a few minutes to say thank you to you for everything. You're such an intricate part of this. I brought my idea, my, my thought to my friend Yelena and she did everything in her power to make sure that my dream is her dream. She made sure that everything she was gonna do to be in alignment. And the fact that both of us are not only soul sisters, but we're also from the same part of the world made it easier to speak woman to woman, heart to heart. But you should well, speak even woman to man. It is important. Of course, That's yeah. why we have conceived this program, Women yeah. Zoom. So the man can understand better the woman for That's living right. together in peace and in That's equilibrium. That's right. So what I plan to do is I plan to open up a safe haven and a safe haven will be, I'm going to have it in Maryland because that's where I'm from. I'm actually, yes, correct. I am Mrs. Howard County, but also I'm Miss Maryland first runner up. So um, I plan to use that title to get exposure as a platform. I want to open up a safe haven which will be <clears throat> a building, a complex where some show up on our doorstep, no questions asked. We'll bring you in, we'll give you food, we'll give you shelter, we will retrain you, we will give you psychological, physical, social support. We will give you job placement. We will help you to transition into a different type of housing. We will do everything we can to get you back on your feet. Good. That's what, what I what I want to do. Anyway, we'll you are a foundation. Do you have yes. any board who conduct these things? You consult them? How works your foundation? 
Sure. My foundation consists of an intricate um, board, which I am so happy and honored to have. My uh, website, my professional board is bellalevy.org. And on that website, you can find information about myself. So um, my board members are actually from all over the world. Okay. Uh, I'm not gonna list them all in entirety, but I'm actually happened to speak to one of them right here. Elena is an amazing person. She's been so helpful with everything. She is helping with so much. And each, each one of my board members brings a certain type of hope, a certain type of inspiration. And I can't thank any of them enough. My organization, my foundation would not work without them. Um, I have a gentleman by the name of Paris, who is literally, you know, when I'm out of town, I'm actually in, in Las Vegas right now, you know, promoting and doing other things. And, and you know, always, I'm like the driver of the bus, but my, my but board members- place to be. Yes. My board members are my gas, are my tires, are my everything. And I do have to say that I was so honored for this opportunity, for this, um, for this meeting. And I have to say that it's because of Yelena and she helped me orchestrate all of this. And um, there's been a lot going on on my end with you know things I'm trying to do. I'm always looking forward, looking forward, looking forward. But at the end of the day, the foundation exists to help people. Right. The foundation exists to take a heart that's broken and try to heal it somehow. Mm -hmm. um, part of what I do is I have these t-shirts that I actually wear and I'm the founder. Mm -hmm. And on the back, I don't know if you can see this or not, on the back is a QR code. Are you able to see that? Yeah, champion of humanity, great. Yeah. Uh, but you can see the QR code, right? Yeah, yeah, I see the QR code too. So the QR code was originally devised as a marketing method. And then I thought about it. How can I help somebody right now? Not a safe haven that's going to be built soon, but right now, real time. And the, the QR code, if somebody scans it with their camera, it gives mm -hmm. you three on my website. The number one option is, do you need help? Can we call the police? Number two is, do you want to go to the website? And number three, are you interested in getting involved, getting merchandise, or uh, looking, looking to donate? And I thought about it, and this came to me. A lot of these girls that are held in situations they don't want to be in, yeah. such um, the, in the sex slave, in the, in the sex industry, they're given these phones, right? Yeah. Well, the phone has a chip on it because the people that are doing this, they want to make sure that they, they track them. Yeah, yeah. The phone cannot dial out. They can't. The phone can only receive calls, but the phone has a camera on it. And if a young lady was to see one of these codes, and I want to make sure I've been working so hard dealing with major hotel rooms, uh, ma major hotel franchises, cab companies, airports, everywhere that somebody can be. Very if they intelligent organization. Yes. It, no matter where you are, if you see that code and you put your phone to it, the camera is going to take the QR code, which is going to land you on my page. And then the very first thing you see is police. Very and that way how to help somebody right now. That yeah. is a way how to be proactive as a way instead of being reactive so My compliments to such intelligent work and such a courageous project you are doing anyway we want to hear even elena mizernaya you have spoke about her i spoke about her let's give the microphone to her to tell us why she is to such project and very good supporter I know you are well, a multi-talented lady, but concretely sure. to this project. 
Thank you. Well, I think whatever Bella Levy is doing is absolutely a vulnerable cause. And it's great that, you know, some other people want to help others. It's really um, not, um, I would say, uh, it's not everybody like that. <laughs> well, and I think it's wonderful and great. And, great. and of course, I, you know, whatever I can do, I would, I would love to be part of it and, you know, to help. Absolutely. And it's wonderful. I, have, I think it's a big problem in the world as well. <laughs> I have okay. that. I have to tell you that when I reached out to her and me and Elena have been speaking now for about a year. Mm -hmm. Something like that, probably. Yeah. A little, a little, a little under. And this was when this project was just a fetus. It was just an idea, a dream. Yeah, I reached uh, out, and she said, "I support you." And I asked her to take the pledge. She did the pledge in English, and she did it in Russian. That's another project that I'm working on. Also, it's a side project. But right now, I want to segue into being proactive. Apart from the safe house, if somebody has a way how to, you know, get help right away. But what I have to say about my dear friend, my amazing humanitarian woman that I'm looking at right now, it's a sign of her character. It's a sign of her reflection of who she is. It's a sign of the type of woman that she is, that she wants to help other people. That's what drew me to her. And I am just so honored that I'm surrounded by such good people. It's because of her that I'm speaking to you, sir. Yeah, and I- Right, I, I do agree. I am so satisfied having a friends like Elena Mizrenaya. And uh, for sure, it's a good uh, accept to, to your project. She will give a lot by herself to your project. Is that right, Elena? Of course, of course. She, if I will have time, absolutely. She is very absolutely, modest. Absolutely, because I'm very busy with uh, whatever I'm doing right now. And whatever I have time, I would love to help. Yeah, I'm just, like I said, meeting you way back when was such a good thing. And now the fact that you are sharing my vision yeah. is just, it, it's a reflection of who you are. And the world really needs to know who yeah. you are. Every no. lady, every lady, every person needs something on the field, must contact you directly to your website. Is that right? So give, yeah. give concretely the way they can connect to you. Because That's I know true. there are a lot of ladies in need throughout the world. Yes. So my professional website, which is the Bella Levy Foundation, is bellalevy.org. That's B E L L A L E V Y dot O R G. Please join the mailing list. We will keep you updated what's going on. You could also reach out to me on social media, which is uh, Instagram, which is B E L L A C H K A 2021, which of course in Russian means Belichka. And that's what my family calls me. And that's what I wanna create. I wanna create a family. And just like the back of my t-shirt says, champions of humanity, we're all champions of humanity. That's what I want. And I wanna create a very loving, warm uh, ripple effect of kindness. Cause if there could be so much hate, if there could be so much destruction, mm -hmm. if there could be so much pain and sorrow, why can't there be so much love? Why can't there be so much healing? And why can't there be so much goodness? And that's what be I want to do. Positive. It's an appeal to be positive. And uh, right. by the case, as a journalist, I do appeal my colleagues. They visit your website and they write down something about what you do. So we can help you. You know, media is power. We can help who, do, who does good things like your project. Thank you, Arthur And, uh, and uh, what uh, Elena is doing, we can help. And I do an email directly by my channel to every colleague of me. I know, you know, it is my channel is in Italian, English, and Albanian. 
So to everybody, to every caller, be in Italian or American or Russian one, no matter, just have people who does good things, human things, yes. and who, who invite you to be positive. I yes. like to be positive. So that's why I am with you now. And Thank give you my so compliments much. and my, my support, my modest support. It's such an honor. And coming from you and Yelena coming from you, it is such a big compliment to know that I have your support, to know that you're with me. Even though we're in different states and we're looking at each other at a, at a piece of plastic, oh, yeah. but in the hearts, we live together. I do, have to, I do have to tell the both of you, here I am I'm in Las Vegas working on things and the Wi-Fi has been horrible, just horrible. I've been trying to get a lot of things done. I'm actually at the convention center in the corner, in a corner like a child in school, may I, may I? And I've been trying to go ahead and promote this exact same meeting. And I've been trying to promote other things. The website has been very, very spotty. So I hope that the fact that I try to promote all of this, this particular meeting, I hope it makes it. And if not, I want to be able to promote this on the back end. And again, I cannot, first of all, Arthur, thank you for allowing me to speak my You're voice. Welcome. And Elena Mayadaragaya, thank you so much to you. I cannot begin. I have to tell you, she and Paris yeah, have been... She and Paris have been such a force. Paris is on, on, on another one of my board members. In my absence, they just stepped in and they did everything. And Elena, my dear, I cannot begin to thank you. It's because of you that I'm speaking to this wonderful man. And sir, because of you, my voice is now traveling the channels across oceans, across across mountains. Like you said, media is power. Yeah, and yeah, for I, sure. Okay, I have ladies, I would like to thank you for being part of this program, to give my compli my sincere compliment to what you do, which is important for too many ladies and for humanity, why not? Because such a sickness, I can definite it sickness, is present everywhere. So what yes. you do there is good. And there are different organizations, even in my country, doing the same. We can do a lot with good and positive will, like you are doing every day. Thank you, Elena, for making me to know such a good project and to make this interview. I, I really feel satisfied of that. Yeah, I'm very honored, Elena. Oh, I can't begin to tell you how grateful I am to you. I, I, I just can't find the words to tell you that. So thank you again for everything. It's a good one. See you ladies and have a good work. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you.